Performances at theaters and other venues across the nation have been canceled. The loss of revenue could be devastating to smaller venues that rely on ticket sales to cover most of their budgets. Our Joel Hillen reports. It feels very quiet and oddly too quiet. The main stage of the Town Hall Arts Center in Littleton is absent actors and audience. This place should be gearing up. We should be Staff should be presetting props. We should be getting ready in the box office for a matinee, and it's just eerie quiet. Robert Michael Sanders is the center's education manager. They joined hundreds of other venues in canceling shows and other programs. It's kind of like taking that rug and just pulling it out from under you and going, now, now what? Now what do you do? You feel powerless and out of control, and you, you just have to deal with it and roll with it and do the best you can, and hopefully we'll be able to bounce back from it. Matthew Kepler is the center's programming manager. No shows means no revenue. Over 80% of our revenue is ticket sales. Canceling the six remaining performances of their current show means the center is possibly out fifteen to twenty thousand dollars. We're hoping that most of our patrons who are financially able will turn that ticket value into a donation instead of asking for a refund. A small gesture to help keep the arts alive and vibrant across our state. We are artists, we create music and, and theater and how we tell stories. Um, that, that's what we do. In Littleton, Joel Hillen, covering Colorado First. Now the folks at the Town Hall Art Center stress that they would provide refunds for tickets if requested and they invite everybody when the time is right to get back out and support live entertainment.